Hey everyone, it's Jesse here. It's 10 8 2015, 9 38 p.m. Time just changed, saw it again. Um, an update video, nothing happened last night. A paranormal, um, no whispers, no voices, no scratching, no, no more scratching. Um, no knocks, no scratching sounds, no, nothing. Just nothing. I'm, I'm totally getting a kick out of what was on my Facebook right now. Somebody posted a post about the whisper about this church getting run out of town by high school students. That's so funny. It's, it's just funny to me. Don't even get me started on the Westboro Baptist Church. I don't even give those folks the time of fucking day anymore. Anyways, um, I got videos set up to, let me look, I've got videos set, um, I've got one video set to go tomorrow at 9 a.m. It's nine day old puppies. Then, Saturday, I got a video of 16 day old puppies. It's gonna, it's gonna go up at 9 a.m. I've got a video that will go up on Saturday at 3 p.m. called Midnight Possum Madness. I actually got footage of the possum up on the fence and it was at midnight. So, or near there. So you'll see that on Saturday. You'll see this vlog on Friday. I won't vlog for the weekend, but you will see those videos on, on Saturday. But anyhow, um, Mom, she actually, and I've been on Mom, the woman did come home from the nursing home again, so Mom has been working for her. Um, supposedly, they pushed enough antibiotics through her to get rid of the C. diff or whatever it's called. Um, and so mom's been working nine hours a day there. And next week, she's gonna have to start working like nine to nine. We're talking 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. or 9 p.m. to 9 a.m. And she's gonna have a, a, a second person uh, helping her or whatever, like a, you know, a team and but the woman is not like she's 85 I think and but she all oh, she has a cane to get around she doesn't have a walker wheelchair she does she's not bed bound um, she goes to the bathroom on her own she can cook but mom did the cooking today she can cook but she has a, she's starting to get Alzheimer's and so she'll forget and walk away and do something else mom said so Mom did the cooking today, and then Mom got back here. She did a little bit of cooking here, which I could have done it, but she wanted to do it. Um, she put some black-eyed peas in the crock pot with some ham hock, and so that's finished. And you cannot believe the smell in here. It's just, it's just to die for. And I can't wait to dig into some of that for supper. But what's funny is, <clears throat> uh. I usually take this mom's little cell phone, even though it doesn't have minutes on it, I take it and set her alarms for her because she's not very technologically inclined, if you will. And so she messes it up. So I'm, I've set her alarms for her. Well, I knew she was really tired today, so I figured she would probably be asleep. So I went over and pecked on the door and went and got my key. Didn't hear nothing. So I went and got my key, unlocked the door. She's passed out on the on the couch just from pure exhaustion she was very tired today but what's so funny and what you you guys are probably gonna laugh at this but she is topless now I have not seen my mother topless since I was young why she's laying there without a shirt on I don't know like I get women not wearing bras when they're not you know when they're wanting to be comfortable or when they're wanting to lay down but why in the hell my mother's not got a shirt on I don't know so I tried not to look once I saw it once like I didn't hit me until like I was I had to look for like three seconds to for real I was like for real mama you know granted she did have the door locked but 
it's, you know, it's not really bedtime yet, and she doesn't usually normally go to bed till after 10, and I needed to get her phone and set her alarm for her, and so I quit looking as quickly as possible, and grabbed the phone, locked the door back, brought the phone over here because it's dead, I'm charging the phone for her, her charger, she don't know where she, what she did with it. So I'm charging the phone for her and going to set the alarm for her and then take it back in there and somehow not look at her. I hope I don't wake her up because then it's going to startle her and then she's going to do that or something. I don't want her to be embarrassed. I don't want her to know. I don't want her to find out that I've seen her in topless. But um, <laughs> who wants to see their mother topless, you know? But I mean, it's not that big of a deal. Really, it's not that big of a deal, but it's just funny. Um, it's just funny. I got a giggle out of it. And tomorrow, I'll tell her. She'll. I'll be asleep when she goes to work, but tomorrow when she gets home, I'll tell her. I will. Be like, Mom, I come to tell you that the Black Eyed Peas was done and set your alarm on your phone, and guess what? You weren't wearing a shirt. That's just so funny to me. Anyways. My paranormal activity video has quite... Not a, it only has 108 views yet so far. But 60 comments. I took a small nap today. And... Like an hour and a half, if that... But I needed it so bad. Um, my dogs. I guess something did happen. My dogs will go crazy. Excuse me. My dogs will go crazy for no reason. Um, like I know when they go out back. That they're usually out there barking at a critter. But. Sometimes I'll go out there and there's nothing out there. No critters, no squirrels, no possums. Nothing. Nobody making noise. No neighbors out in their yards making noise or anything or talking. Um, but, like, even during the day, I'll be sitting here and the dogs will just all of a sudden just start going nuts. And they'll run outside or the ones in here like you can see them sitting in that chair out there. There's Starlight and, and uh, Lily in the chair. Did you hear me say your name? I love you. They're not happy with me because I took the flea spray to them. Which is just a precautionary measure. measure. It's got stuff in it to, to kill flea eggs. And in case it's getting winter time. And in case the fleas start hatching. I don't know. I'm just, I bought some spray, so I sprayed, I sprayed them all down, and they're not, all of them are pissed off at me, even Starlight, she, I, when I took my nap today, I took her in the bedroom with me, and usually she gets in the bed with me, at every time I get in the bed, well, today she was pissed off, she was pissed at me, because I sprayed her, and uh, she wouldn't, she wouldn't sleep in the bed with my nap, she laid down there in the floor, so they know, they like, totally don't like getting sprayed with anything, <laughs> Or any kind of preventative, like I um, buy, um, I don't even know what the name is, but it's expensive stuff. And it's just, you drop it on the back of their neck. It's like oily. They really hate that. But this other stuff that I bought is, uh, it's not as harsh. It doesn't stink. It doesn't, it doesn't hurt them. You know, it's made for dogs. They just, they just really don't like it. <laughs> I wouldn't like it either, I don't guess. Somebody sprayed me with some shit. But it's a preventative measure, like I said. I don't want the, when I, I've got the heat on, I don't want the, the uh, if there is any flea eggs, I don't want them to hatch. Because two years ago, we had a, we let a friend, we babysat a dog for a friend for just three or four days. And I didn't know it, but the dog had fleas. And so the dog brought fleas into the apartment. 
and we had an an absolute infestation of fleas. I mean, you could not walk anywhere in this apartment without getting fleas on you. So we had to get poison and poison the floor, and it was just a nightmare. It was just like a living nightmare. And ever since then, ever since we got rid of them, I finally got rid of them. I'm just so scared that the flea eggs, if there's any flea eggs, they're going to hatch again and we're going to have the same problem. But it doesn't even look like it's nearly going to be like that or anything like that. So I really am just worrying myself for no reason. But I think that we got them cleared out and everything's fine, you know. But like I said, it's just a preventative measure for the, uh, the, uh, spray that I bought. It's not to kill, I guess it kills fleas on contact, but it, the reason I bought it, because it said kills flea eggs for a, up to a month. And so, I was like, yeah, I don't want the eggs to hatch if we have any. Okay, battery's flashing. That means that it's time to end the vlog. And I'll say, peace you ends. I'll see you next week. And I love you. And, yeah. You enjoy my videos t on Saturday. There'll be two videos on Saturday. Two videos tomorrow and two videos Saturday. Alright guys, peace.